Say all right, so first and, form, first and foremost, I want to give all praises and glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yoshai, Bashem, Kakodash. We said, I'm a supposed to let us agree with the teachers of Apostle didn't shoot. And we said, Salutation, so we act and we said, Pushing the word in our truth and sincerity day in and day out, day in and day out, and constantly in season and season. We say, Shalom. And once again, going into a video here, and it's basically touching upon, you know, being a soul for the Lord. And when you look up some of the characteristics that a soul have, those are the same characteristics we're supposed to have for the Lord. Right, and we're supposed to continue to have now. Before I continue, let me just, let me just open with the scripture. This is the book of Second Timothy, chapter 2. I will start from verse um, start from verse 1. It says, Thou therefore, my son, be strong in the grace that is in Yahweh Shai Mashiach. Right, it says, And the things that thou hast heard of me among many witnesses, the same commit thou to faithful men who shall be able to teach others also. You see, you see, thou, thou therefore endure hardness as a good soldier of Yahweh Shai Mashiach, right? And that is the thing, you see, you see, thou therefore endure hardness as a good soldier. And then one of the things that soldier does have to endure, when you, when you watch the things that soldier does endure in, in this world, how, how, let, you, let you just watch, like, for example, the American army, right? They want the things that's both upon, there's whole, there's whole to high standards. How, how the army men is, how the army personnel is, how they, just, how they, were, they were going water for three days, they were staying in harsh environments, you understand? And, and, and some of them, some of them, it reached the point where some of them will sacrifice their life for the country. You, you, see, it in the, you see it in videos and so forth. We do this for America, you know how this is going. And you don't know, when the Lord said in your heart, is a good soul, you, you have to be in this more than that for the Lord. You understand? Because that, that is what we have to be, we have to be a soul for, for your house, right? Right, and we had to be that 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 great soul here. We had to be that soul that that could be what endure hardness. But they were soul. Let's do the things as even the training, right? Even the training that the soul is as this go to is 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 harsh training. You understand? So that when they go to fight the real stuff, they 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 go. It, it, it basically be this. It basically be the same thing, and they will be able to go through it and and not not turn around. It's the same way. We had to be more for the Lord. You know. The things we may, the things we, we we may be going through now, right? It's a, it's a test us. It's a it's a it's a it's a, um, it's a test. We we courage, we commit, man, and we are for the Lord. It's, it's here, right? It's here the, the what is the characteristics of a good soldier? It say the three C's is the is that a good soldier would display in the outside of his career, right? It say a courage, commitment, comradeship, and integrity. And there is so many things that we're supposed to have integrity and so courage. So even even the things that we, we may face in going through, we have to have that courage, we have that commitment to the Lord. To endure, as you say, endure hardness. You know, some of the things we, we may face in things, um, man, lose your work, lose your family, lose our whole set of stuff for the Lord. But there is the, whether, whether what, the whole integrity for who? For Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. At the end of the day, you want to be, as I say here, to be the, as a good soldier and to be that good soldier. And you have to understand what, it is, what the characteristics that a soldier have and how he should oh, and how he's supposed to be. You see, what are the qualities that are essential of a soldier, right? A, so, a soldier's values and standards, right? They say courage, discipline, respect, to, uh, respect of, for others, integrity, loyalty, selfless commitment. And we know we know this Lord said to what to make ourselves what live and sacrifice. For who? For him. So you have to understand the things that come with being a soldier. Because again, when it, when it, when you watch these soldiers in this world and the kind of the kind of the, the things that they go through to become a first and, first and foremost the things that they go through to become a soldier it has be tough some people fall off some people some some people die doing them trainings you understand and then when you become a soldier you face other stuff you face the, the real thing now and and just because you went to the training and so forth you, you, you go through it normal right or you go through it how you're supposed to go through and when it comes to the lord we have to be what? We have to be that so that the, the things that we face and now we endure it. Because the things that we're going to face coming up, it's going to be way worse. And we have to endure that as well. You understand? We have to endure that as well and endure it as well. A good soldier, right? Endure it, endure it as a good soldier, right? Um, the next one here. It's a, um, it's a, it's a seven core values of, um, it's a loyalty, duty, respect, selfless service, honor, integrity, and personal courage. And yet, again, a soldier, a soldier would, would do what he would receive life 
for whoever it is he's serving for for whoever it is he, he's serving right and the same with the lord we, we serve in the lord so we had to do what we had to go down straight down to the end straight down hey you say rather you live you live for the lord and you die you die for the lord and you put that in your mind being that be as i say here thou endure thou therefore endure hardness as a good soldier of your shai mashiach they say no man that worried and target himself for the affairs of this life that he may he may please him who had chosen him to be a soldier right and that's the thing but we the the, the affairs of this life is only for, is, it's temporary you understand the, and, the, and the and the things of this life is what it's what will break you from being a soldier you see you see you see you see how they train a soldier in the world they say let me yeah, forget your family forget your kids you know your, your main purpose is is is, is for this place and we and we go watch and we consider that as like that is brainwashing because we know it is you're gonna fight for a country that we even care about and so forth but when you're fighting for the lord and being a soldier for the lord you know he's he basically watching over you he's there to save you you understand you're doing it for a purpose and you're doing it, you're doing it for a reward but you have to be able to as i say endure hardness as a good soldier because because the things are coming our way we have to be able to endure you understand the trials the tribulation that, that, that we will be facing we have to endure as a good soldier you understand we have to endure as a good soldier let's say no man that worried and target himself with the affairs of this life that he may please him who had chosen him to be a soldier and if and if and if a man also strive for masteries yet is he not crowned except he strive lawfully right they say the husband man that labor it must be first partake of the fruits more first must be partake of the fruits consider what i say and the lord give thee understanding all things right right so you have to understand that hey being a soul of the lord we have to endure things we have to we have to think you, 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 you can't call you, you can't want to call yourself a soul and not and not have these characteristics that a soul have you know and it have way more characteristics than what i look up here this is just some but you get the idea of it right you get the idea of it You say a duty to fulfill your obligations that that's all that we know we have to do we have to do the work you understand selfless service be, be now what that sacrifice for loyalty be loyal to the lord when anything that come away but the face the lord because now being a good soul is saying your hardness when the mot become and you're being a soldier you go stand for the lord but being not being a good soldier obviously you, you wouldn't have that loyalty you would take it you know you would take it and that is not what you want to do it's a personal courage integrity honor you know that is the things that is the things that i have it it has it, it, it's supposed to have like other means to say to stand firm um stand firm all these things that that it, it, it will be all these things characteristics that will come with being a soul and these things that we're supposed to have for the lord you understand and more for the lord a matter of fact um let me just jump down again a little bit let me go to verse 9 and say wherein i suffer trouble as an evil doer even unto bonds but the word of god is not bond therefore i endure all things for the elect's sake that they may also obtain the salvation which is in um Yahushai Mashiach, with eternal glory you see it is a faithful saying for if we be dead with him we we shall also live with him and that's the thing being a soldier he said a soldier is so let this world they die proud they want to think that this thing die proud for you for whoever it is is serving see me with you we better be faithful unto the lord straight unto what to death being that righteous soldier being that good soldier you know that 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 we was chosen to be right let say for verse 12 we say for if we suffer we shall also reign for if we for i'm um, sorry verse 12 we say if we suffer we shall also reign with him if we deny him he will also deny us that is the thing no no we have a we have, we have a as i say a reward because the lord the lord is not unjust you understand we we serve the lord and we do the things and the things that we're supposed to do the lord will reward us for that but in a you see these soldiers around the world when they go and serve especially in america when they go and serve they lose their life they, they come back broken mentally mash up um mentally unstable the body may be passed maybe so when they come back here they, they're homeless you know they are nothing to turn back to you know that is not what it is it have with the lord 
the Lord will give you your just due. You understand? But you have to be that good soul to be able to endure. That way, see, if we suffer, we shall also reign with Him. Because we know we're going to suffer. The things we're going to face, right? But it says we shall also reign with Him. If we deny Him, He will also deny us. And that is just straight to the point. Right? That is straight to the point. So again, you want to be that good soul that is chosen to be. Right? So with that, we give all praises and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashemi, Oshai, Ba'asham, Kakodash. We sit up on the and Elders of Grimus and Rewal, our teachers, our persons, and shoot. And we say salutations, all the accumulation, we wouldn't shoot. And we say the day and the out in the country, in season and season, we say, Shalom.